Since launching in June 2013, the Jefferson Project, a partnership between Rensselaer Polytechnic Institute, IBM, and the Fund for Lake George, is making Lake George the world's smartest lake. Bathymetric surveys map the floor of the lake this summer. State-of-the-art sensors are currently collecting data about the water circulation, and teams of researchers are analyzing data that will provide unprecedented insight into the many factors that impact Lake George and the plants and animals that comprise its ecosystem. Through the establishment of a sophisticated lake environmental monitoring and prediction system, scientists will learn how the lake has changed in the past, observe how it functions in real time, and predict how this valuable resource will change in the future. The water in a lake like Lake George is very important, not just for preserving uh, recreational uses, but for understanding how to have balance use and preserve the quality of fresh water and water resources and water security if you look around the world is a real critical issue. One of the most exciting pieces of this project is that we're based in Lake George and, and that's a great place to do the science. But we all understand that the discoveries we're making, the technology that's being invented, the interdisciplinary nature of the scientists working, the approach that we're taking and the insights that we're having are really applicable to lakes around the world. It's an extraordinary opportunity. It's an unprecedented partnership. And I think the promise is uh, like nothing I've ever been involved with before. Um, I couldn't be more excited. Lake George, like many water bodies around the world, is facing a number of stress points. Things like invasive species, things like runoff from the surrounding land are causing the lake's water quality to degrade. So we have a number of sensor technologies, a number of big data technologies, and a number of computational modeling techniques that we hope to bring together from around the world here at Lake George to study the impacts of these stressors on the lake. At the Darren Freshwater Institute, we will have a world-class data visualization center. What we will be doing is instrumenting and networking the lake. So we will put in sensors that can take those measurements real-time in an automated fashion. The data will be transmitted back to our visualization computation facility. We're sensing the movement of the water, the nutrients that are in the water, all of the plants and animals that are in the water, and we're doing this for multiple years. Together, we expect that we'll see emerging discoveries that no one was even looking for. Our students, of course, will be the environmental stewards of tomorrow because they're the ones who will be here tomorrow. And if we educate them in the right way, then they will not only have the orientation to be the environmental stewards of tomorrow, they'll have the tools and the approaches to in fact do that.